Hi, I'm Candy Duncan. I'm the managing partner for KPMG in the Washington Metro offices. KPMG is an international accounting firm. It's one of the big four, as it's referred to. And uh, we have offices, you know, in 152 different uh, places around the world with almost 150,000 people doing audit, tax, and advisory services. Managing Partner has a lot of responsibilities. It can be anything from going out into the market and helping win new work. Um, we have approximately 1,700 people in the Washington metro area, so there's a lot of HR uh, items that you deal with, and you're also the face of KPMG in the local community. My mom was a fourth grade school teacher, and uh, she had one rule, and that was that all three of us would go away to college. Um, which was not that common at the time, you know, in a rural community, a lot of the, you know, kids would go back to work on the farms, you know, once they graduated. And in my graduating class, which was less than 100, there were only three of us that went to, you know, schools that were outside the immediate area. You know, I loved math as, you know, high school student, um, thought when I went to college, I'd look for something where that was a good fit. And actually ended up in the business school and thought, hmm, I like the accounting classes, let's look in that direction. And actually uh, pursued it and really enjoyed uh, those opportunities. Did an internship uh, during my junior year with a public accounting firm and I liked the work. It wasn't sitting at a desk all day. It was out working with people. It was solving problems. It was trying to make sure that, you know, you were coming up with ways that you not only could verify the numbers and the information that were in their financial statements, but maybe also help them in different ways to improve their business and how they looked at things. My college career couldn't have been better. I really ended up at a school that was just right for me, significantly larger than the high school of less than 500 students. It was a college of almost 20,000. It was, you know, a whole new environment that opened a lot of different doors. I think looking for opportunities outside your home base is absolutely critical. Uh, you learn a lot more than just the book learning when you go away to college. You learn about life in general, lots of different people, uh, lots of different ways of doing things, and that is just as much of a growing experience as the classroom. Graduate degrees are very important in many different uh, future work environments. Um, when I graduated, you did not have to have a graduate degree. Today, you do. You have to have a Master's of Accountancy to be able to sit for the CPA exam. So it may be something that you want to do right after you finish your bachelor's, or you may want to work for a while and then go back and get a graduate degree. In accounting, it's really important that you get that fifth year, you know, before you can sit for the CPA exam and before you can really launch your career. In hindsight, I wish I had taken more writing classes. Communication is absolutely key to be successful in the accounting world. And most people would think it's numbers, numbers, numbers. But no, you've got to be able to communicate. You've got to be able to write. And you've got to be able to get that story across. Because if the message isn't heard, then really you haven't accomplished much. Internships are really important to, I think, anyone that is not definitely sure or, or just wants to try what they think they want to do over a long period of time. I found that the internship just really confirmed that what I thought I was really going to like, um, being right there and doing it, having the opportunity to observe others that were one year, two year, ten years, you know, ahead of me, really made me sure that this was something that I wanted to do. You know, my first position was right out of college as a staff accountant um, started out on the audit side and uh, would go out on audits and do a variety of different things, whether it was verifying cash or helping uh, review financial statements or other projects, and worked my way through the ranks up to manager, uh, became a partner after I'd been with KPMG for about 12 years, and then I did primarily public company audits 
did a lot of IPOs or initial public offerings, taking companies public. Um, some names that you might know would be Family Channel, Dollar Tree Stores, you know, companies that I started working with when they were very, very small and watched them grow and do all kinds of exciting things along the way. Accounting is a really exciting career. One, it is something that you can go in lots of different directions. Whether you want to be in public accounting, you want to work in corporate America, you want to teach, the flexibility is phenomenal and I think that is great for a woman. The accounting world really cracks you know, the door and the insight into what's happening in a business. I think you've got to know the numbers to be successful in business and to understand how to make improvements, how to make changes, and then you've got to work with the team to be able to use that information to move the company forward. I see more and more women going into the accounting field. It is just so perfect for all the different changes that women often go through during their 20s and 30s. And it gives them a lot of flexibility. Uh, women are good listeners. And I think a lot of times you've got to gather information and you've got to be a good listener to be able to take that information and then process it. When I started out, my goal was to do the very best I could every single day. I had no idea I would be sitting in Washington today as the managing partner of KPMG on KPMG's board and working with some of the most prestigious companies in, in the world. It is a matter of just lots of little steps that for me has added up to a phenomenal career and phenomenal opportunities and has really been very, very rewarding.